Hey, this is Susie Cheel and this is the weekly forecast for the Heart Whisper Oracle Card readings. Yes, I'm Susie Cheel. I'm the creator of the uh, Daily Guidance Heart Whisper Oracle Cards. And each week I do a reading. Just three cards usually. And I it's whatever is coming from my heart so what i'd like you to do now as you're watching this just um get still and put your hands maybe on your heart and take in a deep breath and just keep breathing while i shuffle the cards and ask for the guidance you require to bring in limitless love, limitless abundance, whatever is going to um, drive your passion, your purpose, and make your heart sing. So let's see what we've got here. I'm going to take three cards, and from there, I, uh, we will look at what this forecast is. So I'm just putting down one, two, three. And we've got here. Number one is, number one is your heart knows. The message on the card, for those of you who like to get the message, got a, oh, this applies so much to me, how I was first thing this morning. Got a whirlwind in your mind. Take the time to be still. Whisper to your heart. Tell me and listen. So often with our life, with our businesses, we don't actually listen. We get those nudges from within that say, oh, I should be doing this or I should go there. But we don't. And we might miss a real opportunity. So this is our challenge card for the week. Challenging everybody to take time each day to sit in some stillness as you start the day after maybe you've done your gratitude, you said, I love you. You ask, how may I serve? What's my message for the world today? So our focus card, oh wow, our focus card is focus. How amazing is that? What will you focus on today that will bring you closer to your heart's desire? That ties in so beautifully with um, the magic of this card, your heart knows. So when we focus on what we really, really want, and sometimes, you know, that's not hard. We get distracted by social media, so many calls, whatever else. So this is a week to really focus on moving forward, doing, taking the action that you need to take that is going to, in my case for me, bring in more abundance, bring in um, more income. Because I was told yesterday, I never asked for the sale. I don't see it. So um, I've been set a challenge this week by a mentor to make a certain amount of money. Maybe I'll make a little graph and share with you. So what will you focus on this week? And is focus something that's easy for you? And our third card, looking forward, is the yes card. So is there something that you're not so sure about? Uh, will I say yes, will I say no? The message on the card is, as you say yes to love, to life and to you. Your heart whispers, thank you. So I'll give you an example for me. I was challenged yesterday as to why I don't have, which you can see behind me here, my art online. And uh, just watch my Facebook profile page later for a big showing of what's coming. Yes, yeah, so I've been hiding it all away, uh, not selling it and uh everybody was amazed i had an etsy shop what a red bubble shop 
but I haven't been telling other people about it. And this came about because somebody said, I don't know how I can buy from you, Susie. So maybe that's something that you need to think about this week if there's any challenges. And it might not be to do with your business or money. It might be to do with love. It might be to do with yourself. So you're going to really take some time each day to listen to your heart. Focus on your true heart's desires. Focus on your true heart's desires and say yes. Say yes to something that maybe you get that nudge from your heart, but you forget. So that's the reading for the week. Um, I will be dropping the links below for where you get the cards and how you can book the February special, a half price reading just for February to help everybody get really clear and move into um, 2020. And I'll be sharing some links to some testimonials where those um, where that's possible for you to achieve what other people are getting as well. So everybody remember, love yourself into abundance. Namaste.